Hi, I'm Scott Bradford from the Rio Grande Tech Team, and today I'm going to show you how effective and easy it is to use the Firefly Curing Chamber to cure your RTV molds and photopolymer resins. First, let's examine the components. You should have one Firefly hyperbaric pressure and UV light chamber, one stainless steel stand, one air coupling, one AC power supply, one sling bag, and three stainless steel mold frames. To cure new molds, we're gonna use a clear RTV compound. Make sure to mix it to the manufacturer's instructions. And once we have it poured in, we're gonna place it into the hyperbaric chamber and that will eliminate all of the bubbles that have been incorporated in during the mixing process. So we place it in, install the case onto the Firefly, and screw it in. Now that we have our mold inserted into the hyperbaric chamber, next thing we need to do is add pressure. So we're gonna connect our air compressor to the coupling, and we're gonna turn the pressure up to 30 PSI. And the reason we're doing 30 PSI is because all of the bubbles that were incorporated during the mixing process will get shrunk down until they're virtually gone. Next, we're gonna plug in the UV light. The UV will actually generate enough heat to cure the RTV model in about two hours. After your two hours are up, go ahead and unplug the machine from the wall and release the pressure from the Firefly. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna release the pressure from the compressor by turning this counterclockwise and then I'm gonna release the pressure from the chamber by turning this little brass gnarled screw. And then I'm gonna unscrew the casing to remove my mold. The Firefly has two materials that are sold separately from the kit that are available to use. The master copy material is for making repeatable one-to-one -one master models using your RTV molds. Because there is virtually zero shrinkage with this material, your ring sizes and your stone sizes will be unaffected. These masters can be stored for later molding. The HD avatar material is the castable material. Both will inject the same way into your RTV molds, but for casting instructions on the HD avatar, please consult our website. Now we're gonna inject the master copy into this RTV mold. So we've taken our glass plates, we've sandwiched it on both sides, and we've wrapped the whole thing in rubber bands to distribute the pressure evenly. I'm gonna remove the cap from the master copy and inject it into the mold. Occasionally you will get air bubbles, or the mold won't completely fill. So the sling will actually help you eliminate some of those air bubbles and push the photopolymer into those hard to reach areas. So now that we've injected our master copy into the mold, we're gonna insert it into the Firefly unit so we can pressurize it and cure it. So I'm going to add on the outer casing and I'm gonna pressurize it again to 30 PSI. We'll want to keep it at 30 PSI for about three to five minutes, and then we'll turn on the UV curing for another three to five minutes. Okay, we've turned off the UV cure unit, and now I'm going to depressurize the chamber. So I'm gonna release the pressure on the valve, and then bleed it from the side. Now we can remove the casing and remove our mold. Now I'm gonna remove the rubber bands 
and the glass. And there we go. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us.